loving greetings to you. I have an interesting topic. You know, it made me laugh and, and I'm going to tell you why. This is what to do when someone flirts with your wife. Well, I'm from the old days, I, as you could tell. I'm an older guy. I'm in my 70s already. And so in those days, if someone flirted with your wife, you kicked their ass. There's no question about it. You, you get in their face and you let them know this is my property. I don't know. Things have changed somewhat. Now, the attitude should still be in, in your mind of, dude, this is my wife. And first step, I think, is to use the so technique. Stop your mind. Don't get angry. It's not going to do you any good. But use the illusion of anger and convey it in a way where you're not going to get into a fist fight. So the first step is to give him the evil eye, stand between your wife and him, but be very, um, what's the right word? Calculated, because you don't want him to pull up, roll up his sleeves. You don't want to get into a fight over this. Another thing to do is take it as a compliment. Just, this is strategic. And you go, dude, isn't she awesome? But remember, she's my wife. Don't, don't do anything. Don't just let it go. And the reason why you don't let it go isn't about him and you. It's about you and your wife. There is a deep subconscious component in females that hired you as her husband for your animal protection. It's there. And idiot psychologists may say it's not there or you could ignore it, but why would you ignore if the rain is falling? So you need to be aware that this aspect of your wife needs to be taken care of just like every other attribute so that you could maintain the connection you have with her. Now that's not the connection to focus on. Obviously the connection to focus on with your wife is the connection of love that you have with her. And so you could have a little side note going saying, I need to show more attention to her. I need to flirt with her. I need to be the man in her eyes. Okay? So there's a couple of don'ts. Don't do nothing. You got to do something. Don't just write it off. Don't get into a fight. Don't get so serious that it's going to turn into it as heated exchange because then you'll just look like an a-hole. But you have to be present. You have to be strategic. You have to use your mind. You can't just let it go. And you have to be aware of what a woman is on all levels. You know, women are amazing. They're, you might say that they are, why men marry women is because men have a very difficult time loving. We, we have our hearts somewhat closed off because we're warriors. So we think things through, we build the parapets, We pull out the sword, where a woman is all about transferring that love in her heart into emotion. And so we need to be aware of what our wife is all about. That's why I highly recommend, if you have a pretty good marriage, just get one of my books. Definitely subscribe to the channel so you could learn more from someone who really knows what they're talking about. But get one of my books. It'll help you a lot. If your marriage is going downhill and you're using this as an excuse to see what you could do about it, then you need to course for men, but probably you don't. So again, I'm Paul Friedman. I hope you like this video. I hope you visit again and again and again. And I do hope you're a subscriber. If not, you can do that right now. Other than that, God bless you. Take a look at our website, see what we have to offer you and take care. Thank you.